Once, long ago, there was a goddess. She cherished all life and transformed herself into a mana tree to watch over the world. Thus, the legend began. As time passed, memory of the goddess faded from people's hearts. One day, a man crept into the sanctuary where the mana tree slumbered. With the power of mana, he built a great civilization, but this marked the dawn of a terrible age of darkness. The man forced the world to kneel to his will. His name was Vandol. When souls were trapped in the darkness of despair, a glimmer of hope shone in the hearts of a few brave youths. The fighting was fierce, but they would not give up. One wielded a holy blade that gleamed as bright as the hope in their hearts. But powerless before this light, the darkness was vanished. The power of mana was reclaimed from human hands and restored to his rightful place. But now... Now the people have forgotten the goddess once again. Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome to Sword of Mana, my next LP! So, let's get started, right away. We're starting a new game. This is, for the most part, a blind LP. About as blind as Final Fantasy V was. Which is to say I've played maybe half an hour of the beginning. Maybe, maybe close to an hour in this case, but... But... Whoops. Um... But there's a difference here that makes that even more negligible. You see, whoops, uh, let's try pressing the correct button. You see, it's sort of mana. You can choose between a girl or a boy, and they, and they have different adventures. This is not a cosmetic change, but results in a completely different story. Now, insofar as I am familiar with the story of this game, and I'm not very familiar with it, I am most familiar with the story of the girl. Therefore, I am instead going to play as the boy, because I don't know the first thing about what happens with him. Like, at all. Um, I've played maybe an hour into the game with her, I've played maybe five minutes into the game with him. Um, so let's get started. Uh, in a minute, actually. There's two quick things I need to mention first. The first of them is, this is the first thing I've recorded since I moved. So, things might sound a little bit different. It, it'll take me a little while to get uh, everything accommodated, and please bear with that. And if there's anything that you hear that seems different or weird, then just put it out in the comments, and I will make sure to check on it when I see that. Number two is... I don't remember, so let's get started. Character name. Well, there's only one name I could use. Whoops, no, don't put a J there. There. Cow, because I doubt there's enough space for my whole name. Um, although I feel like I should... Hmm. Actually, wait a second. Okay, I'm back. What I was just checking was if there's an official name. And insofar as there is one, because there's some that kind of isn't, um, it is... Duke. Which I think is kind of, sounds kind of weird. So instead, I'm going to take a third option, and call this guy the Harrow. 
<laughs> yeah, sure, why not? Let's go with it. This dream again? Oh, don't make me watch it again. In the beginning, the world was void. Then the goddess appeared. In her left hand, she held the light of hope. And in her right, the sword of mana. The goddess summoned spirits to assist in the creation of life. Finally, to maintain peace, the goddess cast away the sacred sword. It is said the sword rusted the moment it left her hand. The goddess then transformed herself into a great tree that would sustain and watch over the world. A mystical power guards the sanctuary where the tree stands to this day. Whoa! What a song! I guess that was the song? <laughs> I can practically see the mana tree! Is that so? Your voice is so unusual! It's like I'm dreaming! Thanks for the praise, hero. Your words are magic, and a great encouragement. Magic, you say? Not at all. I'd rather hear you tell me your story about how the Gemma, yeah, the Ergema. I, I think it's supposed to be Gamma, maybe, actually. But anyway. How... How the Gamma Knights defeated the evil Vandal Empire! Unfortunately, I cannot sing songs about myself. Why not? I want to know the truth! Other minstrels just sing about stuff they've heard from other people. They get the story all wrong! Ha 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 ha! A story is just a story. No matter the truth, no matter who tells it, it's still just a story. Then I'll sing your story. Oh, I just remembered. We have a loot at home. I'll go get it. Such a good-natured child. You should get home. The council might be angry if you dawdle. Dad won't be mad. Today is my singing lesson with Lord Franz. Wow, I heard that. What? What? Quit singing. What? Nah, -uh. Lord Franz hasn't quit singing. Wow, what a big house. Break it down! Wait, I feel like this should have the gravelly snake voice. Hmm. But Dark Lord! This is Grant's realm console, Herman's estate! So what? Now this should be like a deep voice. Because he's console? We should allow him to harbor heretics? Heretics in my house? Did something happen to mom and dad? Most certainly not. Eep. But S Sir Herman is a friend of Lord Grand's. Suddenly barge in with soldiers seems unthinkable. Anything else to say? Sir, uh, are you telling me to step aside? At the very least, let us get Lord Grant's permission. It's thanks to him we enjoy peace now. Leave if you object. I have my ways. And that's that. Oh no! I've got to tell Dad right away! Huh. 
Dad, big trouble! We're surrounded by soldiers! What? That's what I said! Also, who's this asshole? Actually, it's the Dark Lord, isn't it? Prince Shroud? You will refer to me as Dark Lord. As a servant of the realm, surely you know the consequences of harboring heretics. Herman, just as I told you. This masked man is the one who burned down Mana Village. What? Who are you? Uh, okay. Now, Prince Shroud, I mean, Dark Lord. Surely there must be... This can't be true! Heretics. I vividly remember how Vandal used them to pull the wool over the eyes of the entire nation. I won't allow you to protect them. Of course not. I'm not one to protect... S what? Subversives? Subversives. Uh... What? What? That's enough of that. If you've got something to say, let your sword do the talking. Oh, this is not gonna end well. Out of my way! Maniclan are okay. Um. Huh. Hey! You're the one who will pay, Bogard! Knowing all you do, yet still you want to play hero? I'll show you. I'll show you the truth! Um... Okay, I think it's probably a good idea to do what the man says. He does have blue hair after all. He probably knows what he's talking about. Um... Well, we're all about to be killed. Probably. Something about Metaclans being heretics? What? What is going on? I don't understand. The heretic girl is here. Go get her. Uh. Uh. Um. I have no choice. Oh wait, no, this isn't the Dark Lord. Um. He took her him the wrong way. All deliberate like. What? Well that instantly sounds tragic. What I'm getting hmm. Okay. Time to run. No time to explain. Take her and go. Hurry! Go! That's... well... Yeah, what is going on? Keep quiet! Just get going! I'll deal with them! Hmm. Okay, well... The music just got hardcore, so... Someone is definitely about to die. I'll try. Um, wow. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Don't, don't let me watch. So as you might guess, that girl was the other protagonist. And it seems she was an exile of sorts. Maybe her village was burned to the ground? Yeah, actually, they did say that her village was burned to the ground, didn't they? She's quite possibly the only survivor. Um, wow. Wow, what a start. What's up with you? Sound like a banshee. For once, I was having a pretty sweet dream. Until you interrupted. Hey, hero. What kind of dream were you having? Wanna tell me what it means? Oh no, I mean, want me to tell you what it means? Okay. Were you eating a rabbit? Or maybe a mooch? Boom! What? What are these things? I hear they're a lot tastier than you might think. Uh... Yeah. A chick? Whoa, the same one as before? I... I couldn't protect her. Only I was left. She... after that... Uh, get real, will ya? It wasn't your fault. Times are tough. A kid like you couldn't protect her. What could you do? Ah, uh, damn it, they're gonna make me name her. Um... She has a... Official name as well. That's actually a real name and not Duke. But I don't remember what it was. And I'm not gonna pause the video again to go look it up. So, you know, actually, I'm thinking I might stop here. I've had literally no gameplay, but this might be a good spot. So, well, I want to try to keep this first episode short for a change to my normal anyway. Actually, I'll probably just upload two episodes on the first day. Uh, anyway, yeah, I'm going to stop up here. But first, before the normal preamble... Or post-amble. Post-ramble, really. There's one more thing I want to mention quickly. Since this is the first video in a series, and ho hopefully I'll get a lot of... and therefore is a good introductory point for new viewers, I would like to just say that if you in have enjoyed this, and you might want to see more, then I encourage you to, you know, hit the subscribe button. I mean, I figure if you've reached this point in the video, you probably enjoyed it. So, if you do that, it helps you track everything, and it helps my channel grow a bit. And if not, well, I'm not gonna, never gonna mention this again after this video. So, there you go. And now that I've said that, until next time, when we name this girl and actually do gameplay, this being Let's Play. Sword of Mana! Blind! I had to think about that for a second. <laughs> With Chaos Blue. And have a good day. Bye!